Today is just a chance to show the public like the results of all of our efforts and what we do at the Marine Animal Care Center uh, by bringing these animals in when they're sick or debilitated or injured and then getting them back up to health so that they can go back out into the wild. Loki was actually with us the longest. He's been with us for about 10 months. Um, he was a cold stunned turtle, which happens when the water temperature gets too cold for them to um, properly function. Um, and then um, Wolverine and Lex both came to us in July. Wolverine was uh, just a blunt force trauma. We're not really sure from what. And Lex was a hooked turtle off a fishing pier that a uh, fisherman fortunately knew to call us to take care of. Um, it was actually awesome. It was like really cool to actually see something that, that, um, that cool to actually go in the water and you can actually see it move a lot. I thought it was actually pretty cool how they got to actually go into the water and stuff all by themselves since they like were more like hurt to care about the animals. You see these guys were hurt, that's why. So people better stop hurting all these animals. All animals are coming extinct. Hopefully we can teach them um, ways that they can help and just bring awareness to some of the uh, threats that are out there for these critically endangered animals. Um, and also just being aware of like what they can do. If they see a stranded sea turtle or marine mammal on the beach, we want them to know that they can call us anytime, day or night, and we'll respond to help that animal. They've been at our center for a few months, and it was definitely an overwhelming environment with a lot of people and, you know, taking pictures and everything, so it's definitely not an environment that they're used to. Um, but as soon as that water hits them, they pretty much, their instincts take over, and they know exactly which direction they need to go to be free and be a turtle.